What am I to do with you? Hey, 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 I'm right here. He's like, I don't care, I'm digging. Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning party. And show me, Kara, what's out there? Show me, show me. It's not Squirrel Friend. Well, Squirrel Friend was out here. Dad just gave him some peanuts. But of course you all stand right in front of where I was gonna. They're out there working in our sewer. Hopefully they don't shut our water off. We're not 100% certain what they're doing, but they've been out here all morning, taking the manhole cover off and shoving things down there and trying to figure out what's going on. I don't know what's going on. Our water's working fine and our sewer's draining fine. Jamie and I's concern was that we've had so much rain. We're on day four of rain. This all could have been snow, but it's rain. <laughs> So we're thinking that maybe they're checking because everything is starting to, not flood, but everything is so wet. So maybe they're just checking for drainage. I'm not certain. What are you doing? Yeah, it's still not snow. I know, it sucks. It's just rain and we want snow. I want snow, do you want snow? I would like some snow, hopefully soon. Like seriously, look at how green Jamie's grass is. This is supposed to be covered in snow and the grass technically should be like brown and stuff, but it's been so warm. It's raining right now, so warm that we just have grass. Very strange for Northern Michigan this time of the year. Very strange, but happens, it's like a cycle. It's a weird cycle. Even the Keweenaw, you guys see us go camping up in the Keweenaw Peninsula all the time. First time in 30 years they had no snow on Christmas, but notice I say 30 years. It's like this weird cycle, I guess, is, Apparently what the farmer's almanac was talking about. I don't know, all I know is I wish there was snow. That's all, I just wish there was snow, but you guys already know that. Oh my goodness, what is happening outside? Is it snowing? Say no, it's not, the sun came out. Which we also haven't seen in quite a few days, so I guess we'll take it. What do you think? She's like, mm. Look, are you breathing on the window? You're making nose prints on the window? So the sun came out. I guess, I guess that makes us smile a little bit, even though we wish it was snow. We're okay with the sun coming out. What do you think, Miss Tipper Tappers? What do you think? What do you think? She's like, mmm, I don't think much of nothing. What are we getting ready to do? I have to work on cards. Actually, right now I'm finishing up the year in review video that went up over on Gone to the Snow Dogs, which if you guys didn't see that, you should go check it out. It was just kind of like a recap of everything we did for the year. I did it on the dog's channel. I thought about doing one here as well, but I mainly did it on the dog's channel. Yeah, yeah. And then I don't know if you guys watched Dan's live stream on New Year's Eve, but there was an announcement that happened over there. Do you guys know what it was? If you do, comment it down below, because I know a lot of you guys were there at their live screen, at their live stream. Again, if you don't know, uh, Dan is the person who edits these videos. You guys know Dan, Mr. RFS Dan, youtube.com slash RFS Dan. If you're not following him, you should be because there, he made an announcement on his live stream. He also did some giveaways on the live stream before that, which was really fun. And you guys had a chance to win some Gone to the Snow Dog stuff even that he may or may not have uh, stuck in his bag at Novi. So he would have some giveaways. Stop scritching your nose. She's like, it's just a little scritch. Just a, yeah, just a little, just a little scritch. All right, it's gonna be one of those days. We should probably get to work. But before that, ready? Three, two, one, go, 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 I mean, it is pretty nice. Oh, there's like four squirrels that just ran further up the tree. It's pretty nice out here today. As much as we wish it was snowing, I'll take a little bit of sun and a little bit of, little bit of warmth coming down. Maybe we'll do some yard cleanup. What have been doing back here, ma'am? Digging that hole? I see a hole there. Which one of you did that one, huh? I'm sure it was one of you. And then, way over here, not in the sand pit, we have another hole. So the squirrels keep burying stuff in the yard and Eleanor keeps finding it and digging it up, didn't ya? This one here, is this your dirty work right here? Eleanor, Eleanor, right here. Is that, is that yours? Did you dig this one? Yeah, you did, you did. I know you did. Yeah, uh-huh, that's your dirty work. Yeah, I know. <sighs> now I gotta fill it in. Ma'am, I literally just filled in that hole. Hey, that's not where we dig. That's not where we dig, we don't dig here. She's like, Mom, I think you're wrong. I filled in that hole the other day too. What are you doing? Did you just take that from Kira? Quit eating the sticks. All right, fill in this hole. <laughs> 
Are you gonna come dig in this one too? I know, you're ripping roots out of the hole, I get it. Like, this is the most fun. And there's no snow, we gotta do something fun. You gonna get it, Kira? Yep. Not if Eleanor stops you, you're not. Good, Eleanor, you tell her. Tell her, we're not supposed to dig here. I was totally just digging here, but we're not supposed to. Yep, grab the root, pull the root out. <sighs> what am I gonna do with you? Hey, 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 I'm right here. He's like, I don't care, I'm digging. This is what we're doing, we're digging a hole. Yep, are you coming to inspect? They're not doing a very good job, trust me. All right, all the new holes filled in. Come on, I know, let's go, come on. Get off the table, Kira. I know, she hasn't figured out how to get you from up there. I know. Come on, let's go in. Come on, we filled in all the holes. Keep going, turn around this way. Thank you, let's go inside. Okay, so we're trying to get some pictures of the dogs for New Year's. Yeah, I'm sorry, but <laughs> am I tormenting you? <laughs> Kira, oh. Kira was behind, she's over here oh, now. Geez. Kira was behind the sheet Silly. playing with dad. Memphis is like, I'm done. I don't want anything else on my head. Don't break the head okay, off. you can take the hat off of her. Don't yeah, don't break, break my hat. Eleanor's like, is it me next? Can I be next? I would totally be next. Ah, <sighs> right? <laughs> okay, let's uh, continue on with the photos. No wrestling with the collars on. Oh, you ready for this? You ready for this? Can you guys guess before I give it to them what time it is? Can you guess what time it is? It's bully stick time! In their safety shoes. There you go, Miss Memphis. As happy as can be. There you go, Miss Kira. Happy as can be. Would you like one as well? There you go. Everybody get your spot. And yes, these are the safety chew bully stick holders. The ones that Kira and Eleanor have, the white ones, are made of nylon, like the nylabone. And they're actually called the Ever Chew. And the one Memphis has with the lines through it, that's the Safety Chew Plus. And yes, if you guys want to get one, there is links down in the video description below and a coupon code. The company is owned by a friend of mine. They have Maya the Mini Husky on social media. And uh, <laughs> you always look so happy when chewing on these. So I know I've talked about them before, but every time I talk about them, I get the comments that say, but where did you get those? So that's where I got them. Also, I posted about these, I don't know, like a couple weeks ago, and some of you were not concerned, but maybe had concerns about the little pieces, because when they get down to the very end of these, see, these are like connected inside here, and it's so they don't choke on those little end pieces. It makes sure that they can't get the end pieces. Somebody had commented and said, put them in the microwave so they puff up. One, that's disgusting. These would smell horrible if you microwave them. And two, these are bully sticks, not yak chews. Yak chews are made out of cheese. Dan, if you can find a picture of a dog yak chew and put it on here, and then maybe find a picture of one all puffed up and put it on here for everybody to kind of show the what they do. Yak chews are made of a really hard cheese, yak cheese from yak milk. That's what I think you were thinking of. These are bully sticks. They're made out of pieces from a bowl. If you guys don't know what bully sticks are, I don't want to be the one to tell you. Just know that they're gross. <laughs> but they're really good for teeth cleaning with the dogs. Um, but anyway, these do not puff up in the microwave. They would smell absolutely horrifying. Uh, so instead, what I actually do with them is I take those little pieces and I put them in a bag in the freezer, and then when I make bone broth, I throw them in the bone broth. Usually I put three to six of the little chunks in the bone broth. So just for some added flavor. I don't know why. I don't actually know if it does anything in the bone broth, but like you guys, I felt like it was wasted by doing nothing with it. So I wanted to do something with them. So they go in the bone broth. What do you think? Are you ready for the new year? She's like, I'm cleaning my teeth first so that I don't have to go get a dental cleaning in 2024. Good plan, ma'am. I mean, you did make it till four years old before you had to have your teeth cleaned. So that's pretty good. Memphis, Memphis had one, what, last, no, 2022, I think Memphis had her last one. Memphis could probably use another one soon. Memphis, she likes to chew on these things, but Memphis doesn't really chew anything else, so her teeth always get kind of, kind of gross. But uh, this has been helping a lot. Between this and the whimsies, if you guys are wondering the dog's dental routine, besides me brushing their teeth a few times a week, it's between these and the whimsies. We try to alternate every night, so. Now you know, and knowing is half the battle. How many of you that watch this even know where that's from? 
What do you think? Is it delicious? She's like, this is the best moment of my life ever. Yeah, I know it is. I love you too. So it is the next morning. And apparently we complained enough yesterday because went to bed last night, woke up this morning, totally not expecting any of this. And not only did it snow a little tiny bit, but it's snowing right now. It's definitely not sticking to like the cement or anything because it's not cold enough, but at least it looks prettier than it did. What do you think of that? Is it snowing out there? I know a squirrel friend hasn't been here. We gotta, we gotta put some peanuts on the porch for him this morning. But yeah, it, uh, it snowed, so we'll take it. But we're also gonna go ahead and end today's vlog so we can start another one. So we hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. Say goodbye, potties. Good night, potties. Even though it's daytime, the dogs are like, let us outside in the snow. Okay, fine, I will let you outside in the snow.